welcome to my channel I'm simply Nepri today I am here with a Vietnamese mukbang <laughs> so I went to this place called Ba Mi Pho Ba Mi Pho <laughs> here in Fort Wayne Indiana and um, I got a Ba Mi I got the Korean pork Ba Mi which is basically a Vietnamese sandwich it has I got mine spicy so it has jalapenos on it it has um, pickled carrots pickled relish it has cilantro and it has like a i don't know what the sauce is it's like a white sauce and then korean barbecue so that's what i got for the sandwich and then on the side i got some um spring rolls these are shrimp and pork spring rolls and then i got some egg rolls too they have some good crispy egg rolls so that's what I'm going to be eating today. <clears throat> so let me go ahead and get into this food because I'm super hungry. Mm. I'm going to take a bite out of this sandwich first. Mm. And cucumber. I got cucumbers in there too. Mm. So the rolls for the bamis are really like crusty. That's how they're supposed to be. So they're very like crust, like crusty, like <clears throat> crispy kind of. On the outside, at least the outside of it is more crispy. The inside of it is still soft. It's definitely spicy. Definitely got some jalapenos in there. So it's like fresh jalapenos, not like pickled jalapenos. Yep, let me see if you can see it. All the vegetables and the meat. I got some, um, this is their, like, it's like a duck sauce that comes with the egg rolls, and then they have a peanut sauce that comes with the spring rolls. And I like the sandwich with the peanut sauce. It's really good with that. So I'm going to dip it in that. Oh, and I have a boba tea. This is peach boba tea with the mango toppings. Yep. And I got mine um, blended. So it's like a slushy. These are so good. They got a whole bunch of different flavors. So if you have never tried these, you should try it. Oh my God, so good. Mm. Those are so good. Got the little poppings at the bottom. It's like at the bottom. It's like the little, you know, like little circle things and they pop in your mouth like you you can bite them and they burst. It's really good. My kids have one too. <clears throat> they didn't get food from there, but they did get um, a bubble tea. My daughter had her chili and bacon today, so she ate there. 
if she ate after 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 school program too that she goes to. She didn't really want no food. And my son, he went to Burger King, so yeah, that's what they ate. And then they had what they used to drink. They are basically in their rooms right now, winding down for the night. And had their showers. It's bedtime is is vastly approaching. <laughs> They've been eight hours ago. I'm just just now eating. I didn't have that big of an appetite at first when I first got home, so it's kind of late. But I'm eating now. This is good. I haven't got my husband in spiders yet. But I think he would like it. Let me eat an egg roll. Mm. That egg rolls are good. I forgot what kind of this is. I think it's chicken. I don't know if you can see in there or not. That is good. It's very seasoned. <clears throat> and I said, like, the next time I go there, I'm definitely going to do a, a mukbang with the pho, which is like their noodles in the big bowl with, you know, whatever you want on it. I'm going to get that um, the next time to go. And I'm going to do a video with that. Hmm. Those egg rolls are good. They didn't roll my spring rolls as pretty as they usually do. I don't know who rolled them today, but I feel like they just put stuff anywhere. Usually they have the shrimp lined up on the top where you can like see it right now. You can see, you can't really see the shrimp that good because the carrots are on top. Then my pork is like off to the side, but it's okay. <laughs> It'll still taste the same. So anyways, you dip these in the spring roll. I mean, not in the spring rolls. You dip this in the peanut sauce. You dip the spring rolls in the peanut sauce. Mm. Still tastes the same. <laughs> Whether it's pretty or not. Mmm. I might have to pour it. I feel like if I dip it it's going my stuff is gonna fall out. Mm. Really good and fresh. I just love spring rolls, period. Especially when you have some really good, fresh, crispy um, vegetables. There's some little noodle things in here, too. Pork, shrimp, carrots, and like lettuce, and some little noodle things. I don't know if you can see it. Can you see it? So today that um the day that I am recording this is Monday. So I had work today. It wasn't a bad day. I feel like I got a lot accomplished. 
hopefully I'll get a lot accomplished this week. I just really, I'm trying to get to the point where I'm back to just my normal day-to-day -day work. Because right now, like I said, it's a time of the year where it's a lot of annual stuff that you have to, like, you know, get together and help with and stuff. So, it's a little hectic, but I'm getting through it. I'm getting through it. <laughs> the time is approaching to where it'll be all be over soon. Well, not all, but, you know, I'll be back to just, you know, a more calm, normal. I'm definitely looking forward to that. But I always feel good when I get certain things accomplished and it's like I'm a weight lifted off my shoulder and I'm like, oh yes. You know, especially when I get it done and I know it's correct. It's all it's out of my hair. I don't even have to think about it no more. And that's the best feeling ever. <laughs> It's just finding the time sometimes. I just feel like I need more hours in a day. It'll be enough time in a day for everything. I, mean, I don't just go for work. I go for home too sometimes. It's tired. You gotta pick certain days to do certain things, you know, and split it up a little bit because and I'm not just saying at home, I'm just seeing your personal life outside of work, period. There's always a lot of stuff to do. Because, like I said, it's got fresh jalapenos on it. I don't know if that's the only thing that makes it extra spicy, or if they do if it's a different sauce. I'm not sure, but I always get spicy. You come back. Everything is good. Literally everything. And I think I'm going to finish all my food today. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. These eggs are so But yeah, so if you live in Fort Wayne, Indiana, it's called Bomb Me Fuck. And it's on Fairfield. It's close to downtown. So good. I always get the Korean barbecue sandwich. But I've gotten the pork one before too. And that was good too. And you can get that one spicy, mild, not spicy at all. And they give you those options. 
<clears throat> but the Korean barbecue is my favorite. That's the one I like really gravitated to the most. They got chicken. They have a bunch of other ones too, so you don't have to get pork or beef. You can get chicken too. And with some other ones too. I don't know what all. I don't remember everyone, but I do know they have chicken. And I think they have a vegetarian one too. They definitely have vegetarian spring rolls. And those are really good still without the meat. Because I used to, um, when I first started going there, I used to get two egg rolls and two veggie spring rolls. With no meat. And they were so good with the peanut sauce. So tomorrow is Tuesday. What day? Tomorrow. Yeah, will be Tuesday from today. <laughs> and I have a um, study connection. So that's why I basically I tutor a student for an hour um, every week. Right at my job. So I like it. It's convenient. It's convenient that it's right at my job. But yeah, it's very rewarding. I love it. I'm my third student. Yep, I really enjoy it. <laughs> and it kind of helps me, you know, refresh my brain too, you know. You know, just any kind of extra help, you know, just like, I don't know. Get to hear, you know, <clears throat> other ways of, the ways that the kids learn nowadays versus how we used to learn before. <laughs> they just like how my kids are. Like, my kids will be like, you know, you're teaching them something, they'll ask you a question and you show them how we learn how to solve the problem. And then they were like, that's not how my teacher did it. And they're like, yeah, I know, you got the answer, but that's not how we're supposed to do it, you know? That's how the kids that study connection are, too. So, yeah. <laughs> Between them and my kids, I'm steady learning new ways to do stuff. So good. I'm trying to tell you. Eat this last spring roll. Let me put this fast spring roll. They did not roll this very cute. But it's all good because it tastes good. Okay, so. mm -hmm. Got fresh vegetables. Yeah. 
house is quiet. It's super, super quiet. Once again, it's a surprise. I'm really shocked at how quiet they've been. They must be getting really used to me doing these videos because they have not made a peep. Unless they fell asleep. Which I doubt it because they never usually fall asleep before bedtime without me having to push them a little. Like, go to sleep, put that down, turn that off, turn the TV down, eventually mute that TV, turn the TV off. <laughs> Whatever I have to do, you know, to wind them down to going to sleep. But I don't know if they sleep right now. I seriously doubt it. They're probably trying to stay under the radar so that I don't <laughs> come in there and tell them to go to sleep. Almost done with this. I love this peanut sauce. It's so good. I can dip. Nope. I can't dip it. I'm gonna spill it. Last bite! Hmm. <laughs> That was that. I haven't had them in a while. And they did not disappoint me. Excuse me. <laughs> mm. Well, if that was good, y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this thing on up. I'm gonna relax a little bit until I get tired. Go unwind. You know, I'm still in my work clothes right now, so <laughs> time to get in relaxed mode. But anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you watch this video to the end. If you like this video, please remember to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I will see you next time. Peace.